Of course, the State Department of Transportation, they're ready all the time. They're on the road where they need to be this morning, plows, salt, and some reminders for all of us today. Yeah, so definitely make sure to leave a little extra time for travel. Don't crowd the plows. Allow extra space for stopping, and of course, be cautious around other cars. Other news this morning, local election headquarters news. The absentee ballot count begins today in the 22nd Congressional District, and it will determine the outcome in that razor-tight race between Democrat Anthony Brindisi and Congresswoman Claudia Tenney. At the moment, Brindisi leads by fewer than 12, uh, 1,300 votes. It's about 1,298, give or take, over Tenney. But they've got thousands of absentees to count. Let's go out on the road and get one final check of the way it really looks out there in Snowland. Lindsay Rachel driving along. Where are you, Lindsay, and how does it look? Thank you. Okay, we are on uh, Route 20 here. We're headed towards Lafayette. We're headed towards the west. We hit a snow burst here, so it is reducing visibility a little bit. The roads, obviously, you can still see the black pavement, but we're still taking it nice and slow, planning um, some extra time in our commute, not hurrying to where we need to get to go. And that's just going to be your rule of thumb for the morning commute. Uh, the snow should get better this afternoon. Kate will have a look at your forecast coming up soon. Thanks, Lindsay. It always looks faster when you when you see those that, mm -hmm. that, that dash cam. Yeah. But it, you, you got to slow down. Yeah. You gotta, definitely. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah.